It, it, well, I do a radio show, but I also do like a video show as well. So, do you see me? <laughs> do you see him at all? Get your chair over. Yeah. No, big fan of Munsters, by the way. <laughs> Never missed it when I was a kid. I would watch that. Yeah. Outside. Windy. Outside. 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 Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Frankie Slosser, and welcome to another great edition of the Frankie Slosser Show. And today, we're live here in Fargo, North Dakota, and I'm joined by Butch Patrick, who was known as Eddie Munster in the hit show, The Munsters. Welcome to the show. Uh, thank you there, Frankie Slosser. <laughs> well, hey, I gotta get my own full name or whatever. I'm calling myself Frankie most of the time. Okay. Uh, well, you're here in Fargo. Uh, I know last week we were in uh, New Jersey. Was that? Yes, I was. I was in Six Flags. Uh, great America, in New Jersey. Yeah, and then you come all the way from New Jersey. Well, I mean, I know you live in California, but I mean, you actually live in Florida. Okay. You live in Florida, though. Yeah. I'm from California. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Just to add another dimension to it, and then uh, I'm going, leaving here, and I'm going back to Chicago to get my cars, and I'm heading to Indianapolis, and I'm heading to West Virginia, and I'm heading to Florida, and I'm flying back to Nashville, and then I'm flying to Muscle Shoals, Alabama. Jeez, so just traveling completely, just like all the time. Put a lot of miles on that. I'm sure you have. You like doing conventions? You know, just just something that just like all of a sudden, just like one day, I just like I just wanted to sort of be a part of it. No, I kind of involved. It didn't just flip the switch one day. It just sort of merged into it. I enjoy the traveling. with the cars. It gives me a uh, sort of a niche situation where I can do my motor events. And occasionally do stuff like this. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, here in Fargo, have you been here in Fargo before? I've driven too far. I haven't been to the state. So uh, the, today I went out and saw the sites. My stepfather's actually very nice. Okay. Uh, the cemetery, so I haven't had a chance to see the grave. We uh, went to the chipper, the door down door. We went to the Fargo Theater. We went to Sally's. Oh, okay. Got up selling donuts. Uh, and then I saw him the other side of the park, which is absolutely awesome. Yeah, we have. We have. Yeah, we have. We we have. Minnesota's got nothing on you guys. <laughs> well, you know, I'm from Minnesota, so we just we camped uh, from there today. And uh, our area is totally different uh, compared to here because all the farmers and stuff have just been going through a lot of crap lately because of all the rain. Yeah, it's uh, definitely a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, what about Fargo kind of just drew you to say, I want to come? this convention. Uh, well, you were invited, obviously, right. but I mean, like, it is. Uh, well, places you haven't been before, so my father's grave. Uh, it's always nice to go. This is, the 40, this is the 45th year, so I know it's a solid show, and it's very family friendly, which I, I like. Yeah. And I'm going someplace I've never been, so it's all good. Oh, well, that's awesome. Yeah. That's awesome. Uh, and I'm sure you've pretty much probably been just everywhere. I mean, because you're not talking about your traveling schedule, so... I've been mean, overseas at all too, I'm guessing, and all that? Yeah, I've done this South America, Europe, Australia three times. Um, I'm working on a uh, nation tour because I've never been there. And I would love to figure out a way to get to Antarctica, but there, I don't think there's a whole lot of conventions out there. Okay. <laughs> well, you know, we just uh, uh, we saw, we watched the new uh, anime. Yeah, there was, was pretty good. When do you think there'll be a Monsters anime movie like that? Probably never. Never? Yeah. yeah, it has to do with the ownership issues with the Munsters and Universal. They're very tight uh, about uh, offering anybody uh, any licensing oh, issues. Right now, Seth Meyers had it. The Wayans Brothers had it. Uh, they just they just can't seem to please Universal uh, with the uh, structure of the show. So I doubt it will ever happen. Oh, well, I mean, hope, I mean it, it would be nice. I mean, it seems like Munsters kind of did their own thing. Like we had the monsters go home, and then uh, then there was like a, a spinoff, a, a spinoff of the monsters show. Monsters Revenge, another movie. Then there were the monsters today. Then there were the first time the monsters. Yeah. Um, there was also a scheduled Christmas in Australia. Yeah. Yeah. But um, it's been done a few times, but nothing like the original. So it was so, like being a part of the, the cast and crew, kind of like a, you know, with Halloween being here, I suppose it felt like Halloween almost every time on the set. I when you're like a little kid dressing up, and it was like, yeah, really good Halloween home movies. Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> so, how, how old were you when you first started on the Munsters? I was 39. <laughs> <laughs> 
They used to call me a 39 year old midget. I was, I was 11 and 12. Oh, wow. That must have been. That must have been so much fun. Uh, yes, it was. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, we appreciate uh, you spending a little time Thank with you. us and uh, uh, enjoy the convention. There's a lot of fun. Lots of stuff going on tonight, I guess. Well, I'm looking forward to it. There's uh, tables everywhere. The whole Your Fargo debut. The whole hotel <laughs> is themed out, so it ought to be good. <laughs> Must have, been like, uh, must have been like Halloween every day on the set. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> Very much so. <laughs> so what do you do on actual Halloween? <laughs> well, you know, it's always good to get advice from her and Fred Gwynn because he was the level head of the set. Yeah, absolutely. Well, we appreciate it. Uh, All right, buddy. I appreciate it. Take care. Thank you. Yeah, great to meet you. Thanks, guys.